Postman Pat and his black and white cat <coughs> Early in the morning Just as day is dawning He picks up all the post bags in his van Postman Pat, Postman Pat Postman Pat and his black and white cat Birds are singing and the day is just beginning. Pat feels he's a really happy man. Everybody knows his bright red band. All his friends will smile as he waves to greet them. Maybe you can never be sure there'll be knock. Ring parcels to your door. Postman Pat, Postman Pat, Postman Pat and his black and white cat. All the birds are singing and the day is just beginning. Pat feels he's a really happy man. Pat feels he's a really happy man. Hi, Pat. Morning, Ted. Here's your post. Oh, thanks, Pat. Special delivery service. Pat speaking. Whoa! Pat, can you get here really quickly? What's up, Ben? Your special delivery's here. <laughs> hmm, we'd better hurry, Jess. Huh? Sounds like Ben needs our help. Let's go. Bye, Ted. Bye, Pat. We've got a special delivery, Jess. What's it going to be today? Ben, meet Daisy. Your special delivery for today. She arrived on the Pencaster flyer this morning. She's for Alf. <laughs> Thank you, Daisy. All clean now. <laughs> the special delivery service can deliver anything. But an animal needs proper care. OK, let's find out what vehicle we'll need. Here we are. An animal trailer. Hmm. Amy's got a horse box. I'm sure she'd lend it to us. What are we going to do now? I'll go after Daisy. You ring Amy. Whoa! <coughs> right. Hello? Amy? We need your help. There's a cow on the loose. That's very nice, Lucy. But I've asked you to only paint things you can see. But I can see a cow, Mrs Taylor. Look! <gasps> oh, my! Cool! What's a cow doing here? It's oh. a cow! It's hungry, that's what. Hey, my lunch! OK, everyone, let's just all move back a little. OK, but... Right, 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 right. Right. What's going on here? It's, it's the a cow, Pissy Selby. Move along there, please. Hmm, causing an obstruction. A bookable offence, that. Now then, who do you belong to? There's no need for that. <laughs> Back again, Pat. Can I borrow this rope, please, Ted? Of course. What's the rush? I've just got to tie up my special delivery. Hmm. Bye. Must be a very big parcel. <laughs> Sorry, I can't take you out now, Pumpkin. I've got to help Pat with his special delivery. Mm. Won't be long. Look, Look who it's Pat! Now then, Pat, 
Is this your cow? Yes. Well, no. She's a special delivery for Alf Thompson. Cows are meant to be in fields. She will be. Just as soon as I can catch her. Stand back, everyone. We don't want to startle her. Oh, well done, pet. <laughs> Daisy cow, Daisy cow, we'd like to stop her, but we don't know how. Running wild everywhere and pulling pack all round the square. Daisy cow, Daisy cow, we'd like to stop her, but we don't know how. Everybody's saying that you've got to stop that, got to stop that, got to stop that cow. <laughs> Daisy! Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Special delivery service? Pat speaking. Pat, how's it going? Oh, it's coming along, Ben. Uh, oh, you can always count on me. Found your special delivery. Great! Thanks for coming to help, Amy. No problem. Let's get her into your horse box. <laughs> Daisy, come back! Pat? Oh, oh, just about. Oh. Hmm. I think I know how to get her into the horse box. Come on, Daisy. Come and get the juicy grass. Last. Well done, Pat. Special delivery service underway. We always get through, don't we, Jess? Jess? That's Jess. Where is he? Amy, I've lost... No, no. Jess? He must be in the back. <gasps> there, Jess. All safe and sound. Special delivery service. Hi, Ben. Hi, Pat. Do you need any help out there? Don't worry. Everything's under control. See you later. Come on, Amy. Let's get this special delivery to its new owner. OK, Pat. Oh, hello, Alf. Alf, just the man. I've got a special delivery for you. A new cow. Oh, I can see you. Oh, oh no. no. Daisy, what on earth are you doing up there? She's stuck. How are we going to get her down? I know. I could airlift her off in the special delivery service helicopter. You'll need an animal harness to do that. I've got one back at the surgery. Brilliant. Now, it'll take two of us to do this. <coughs> Amy, can you help me? I wish I could, but... Oh, well, I'm scared of flying. <coughs> Don't worry, Amy. I'm a very good pilot. You'll be perfectly safe. 
Come on, Amy. You can do it. Daisy needs my help. I'll do it. Don't worry, Alf. We'll get her down. Thanks, Pat. Good luck. Whoops. Oh, well done, Pat. That was a tough one. Didn't think you'd manage it. Uh -huh. Where are you going? No time to explain. We've still got a special delivery to finish. Ooh. Amy, are you sure you're ready for this? Yes, Pat. It's time for me to fly. Here's your safety harness. This'll keep you safe. Thanks, Pat. Operation Rescue Daisy underway. little trip. We're ready, Pat. Well done, Amy. Let's go, Jess. One very special delivery on its way. Don't worry about me, Pat. I'll get down okay. Bye. See you in Greendale. Julie, Julian, cows can't fly. This one can. Well, I never. Here's your new home, Daisy. <laughs> She'll be fine now, Alf. Thanks, Amy. Uh, and thanks to you too, Pat. You saved our daisy. And I loved being a flying vet. Mm. All in a day's work. <laughs> <laughs> Special delivery service. Mission accomplished. <laughs> Welcome, everyone, to the annual Pencaster and Greendale treasure hunt. Yay! This year, we have a very special mystery prize in store for the winners. What, what is, is it? it? If you want to find out, you'll have to follow the clues to the end. Oh. oh, I wonder what the prize is. I'll tell you when I win, Mum. That's the spirit, Julian. Oh. 
special delivery service. Pat speaking. Pat, I need you to come to the mail centre right away. There's a special delivery waiting. Yes, and this one's urgent. We'll be right there, Ben. Come on, Jess, we've got a special delivery. What's it going to be today? Good luck, Julian. What's it going to be today? Pat and Jess reporting for... Shh! This delivery is top secret, Pat. It's the prize for the end of the treasure hunt. A teepee! Lawrence arranged a surprise sleepover for the children at the end of the hunt. She's waiting for you now. Where am I taking it? The directions are in here. It's got to be kept secret. If the children find out, they could cheat and go straight to the end. You can trust us. Mira's on our team. That makes it three each. What about Bill? Bill can be on our team. No, he's on our team. Ours! Ours! I'm not on anyone's team. I'm older than you look. I could do this on my own. Everyone ready? Yes. yes! Good. This is the first clue. When I give the signal, you may... Go! Begin. Let's get a move on, Jess. We'll take the big van. Don't forget your keys. Whoa! The instructions. Quick, stop it. Ooh. Oh, it'll take hours to sort through all these letters. Why don't you just tell me the secret location? I can't. Only Lauren knows. Then, let's call her. What a lovely spot for a campsite. The children will love it. I'll call Ben. Make sure the teepee's on its way. Ah! Oh, dear. What's wrong? There's no signal. Don't worry. It's a special delivery. That's probably halfway here already. <laughs> <laughs> no signal. I can't get through. She could be anywhere, Pat. What are we going to do? There's only one thing for it. If I follow the clues, they'll lead me to Lauren. I'll have to do the treasure hunt myself. Where's everyone gone? The hunt started, Pat. That's the first clue. A light bulb? Hmm. Street lamps, shop lights, traffic lights. There's hundreds of lights. Oh! The lighthouse! Of course! Oh, good thinking. Thanks, Reverend. I didn't know you were taking part in the treasure hunt, Pat. Oh, I can't see it. Oh! oh. Uh, have you seen the treasure hunt clue, Mrs Goggins? You're definitely in the right place, Pat. Hmm. I can't see it anywhere. There it is. Well done, Bill. <laughs> oh, it's too high. Can you get it for us, Pat? There you go, Bill. A carrot? Who do I know who has carrots? I know. Michael sells them. Oh. I'll bet it's him. See ya. Bill, wait. Oh, quick, Jess. We've got to get there first. Why are you on a treasure hunt? Uh, come on, Lily! Oh. Oh. Just a bit higher. Oof. Oh, let me try. I'm taller than you. Uh, uh. You might find it easier if you work together. Good, Good idea, idea, Mrs. Goggins. Yeah. Come on, let's be in one team. Okay. Come on, Charlie. Yeah, I'll pick up the Got it! Here's the next clue. These are too easy. I'll win this, no problem. Bye, Michael. Bye, Bill. Oh, hi, Pat. I'm on the treasure hunt. Have you got the clue? Here you go. <laughs> A bit old for this treasure hunt, aren't you? I'm not doing it for fun, Michael. I've got to deliver the prize to the end before any of the children finish. So, what's the problem? I don't know where the end is. Well, you'd better get a move on. 
Bill Thompson's way ahead of you. Hmm, a rocket. There are no rockets around here. Maybe it's not a real rocket. What do you mean? That's it. The Greendale rocket. The next clue must be at the station. Thanks, Michael. <laughs> Well, there's no need to ask where the clue is. Are you coming with us, Pat? I can't leave until all the children get here. Thanks, RJ, but I'm in a hurry. I've got to stay ahead of the children. If I take the van, I can get a head start. Know where you're going? There's only one place I know where to find sheep. Thompson Ground. Brilliant. Good luck, Pat. But why are you on the hunt? Hi, Bill. You got here quickly. I'd have finished by now if I didn't have to wait for you slow coaches. We're not doing teams anymore, Bill. We're all working together. Yeah. Want to join us? Yeah, come no on. way. Oh, come on. You just hold me up. I could do it on my own. Ooh. That's everyone. All aboard! Yeah! We're ahead of the children and heading for Greendale. Good work, Pat. Keep it up. Hello? What's this? Pat, thank goodness. Can you help? I've got a flat tyre. Uh, I'm on a special delivery, Doctor. I is it urgent? I've got to do my house calls. Oh, right. Well, let me help you. Oh, thanks, Pat. Five? Six, seven. Oh, that's everyone. Now, do you know where you're going? The sheep! The sheep! The sheep. The sheep. The sheep. The sheep. <laughs> Bye! Mmm, that looks delicious. We're just waiting for the teepee now. I wonder what's taking Pat so long. Look! They've all got pink cards on them. That's right, but only one of them's got the clue on it. Which one, Dad? Hey, you'll have to work that out for yourselves. Right. Oh, come okay. on, okay, try this one. It's not this one. It's not this one either. Oh, this one. Oh. That's wonderful. Thank you, Pat. Meow. Coming, Jess. Sorry, Dr. Gilbertson. Got to run. Bye, Pat. Good luck with your delivery. I hope you make it in time. Bye! I wish they'd start still. I can't remember which ones we've checked and which ones we haven't. You're not doing it right, that's why. Go on, then. Show us if you're so clever, Bill Thompson. OK, I will. Everybody choose one sheep, then go and stand by it. OK. okay. All right. There's seven of us and seven sheep, see? The clue must be on one of them. Now, all together, check the cards. It's not on mine. No, mine. Oh, not on friend. this one. I've not got it. Nope. It's a ball. Yay! Hi, Alf. <laughs> Have the children been here yet? Oh, you've just missed them, Pat. Did you see what the clue was? Mm, sorry, Pat, but I can tell you where it is. Molly's got it. <coughs> right, this should be easy. Hello, Molly. <coughs> oh. Oh. Here, let me try. Thanks, Alf. There's a good girl. Hello, kids. Hi. You're almost finished. Yeah. Climb aboard and I'll take you to the prize. Oh, no one, please. Good luck, kids. Oh, hey. Now. Oh, 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 oh. 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 Oi, 
that's me lunch. Good work, Jess. Got it. A boat? It must mean Ted's boat. Come on, Jess. We've got a special delivery to make. Wow. No! Ted! Wait for us! Oh, we've missed the boat. They must be headed for the island. Hmm, that's no good, Jess. There's no way we could row fast enough to catch up now. Not with this heavy teepee. Unless... I think I've got an idea. <laughs> Let's hope this works. Woohoo! Hold on tight, Jess. We're back on track. I don't like the sound of that. Oh. oh, no. The engine's conked out. We'll have to use the sail. Look! It's Dad! Hi, kids! Oh, Hi, kids! Oh. Ahoy there! Made it at last. Hello, Pat. Well done, Pat. We were starting to get worried. Hmm. Uh, but where's the teepee? Right here. What? I'll explain later. Come on, the children are nearly here. Thanks, Ted. Thanks, Ted. No problem. Look, there's a clue. Let's go. Let's go. This way, kids. Come on. Come on. Whoa. Brilliant. This is the best prize ever. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Well done, everyone. Come on, I'm tuck so in. Hard. You missed a brilliant treasure hunt, Dad. I'll bet. Why don't you tell me all about it? Meow. Special delivery service. Mission accomplished. Try one of my new health drinks. Hmm. <laughs> it's cabbage and prune juice. Hmm, cabbage? <laughs> you don't often get that in drinks, do you? No. Special delivery service. Pat speaking. Morning, Pat. I've got a really interesting special delivery. Can you get here as fast as you can? Of course. I'm on my way. Come on, Jess. Let's go. Bye, Michael. See you later, Pat. Mm, now that's delicious. We've got a special delivery. What's it going to be today, Jess? Special delivery service. on his way. What is it? It's a wind generator. Whoa. Ted designed it and had it made. He's going to use it to power his mill workshop. I thought the water wheel did that. Yes, it does. But Ted wants to make everything go twice as fast. Come on, I'll show you. When the wind blows, the blades spin around and make electricity. Wow, it's amazing. Meow. Meow. Lauren's taking the kids to see it working for the first time today. Right, better not be late. We could lift the generator with the helicopter. It should get us there quickly. Um, it might be a bit windy for the helicopter. Let's check. Come on. Whoa! I think it might be best to use the van. Good idea. Go 
Hello, everybody. Hi, Hi Ted. Ted. Morning, Ted. Thanks for inviting us. The kids can't wait to see your new wind generator. Has it arrived yet? Not yet, but your dad's delivering it, so I'm sure it'll be here soon. Who wants to help me hand these out? I, I do. do. I Ted's generator will spin just like these windmills. <laughs> <laughs> wow! Hey, look at this! Whoa, whoa. Oh. Hey, let's get it back here now. Left a bit. There you go. Keep going. Keep going. That's it. That's everything. Thanks, Ben. Come on, Jess. Let's go. Now, soon as Pat gets here, I'm going to stand my wind generator right there. I've seen wind generators before. They go like this, don't they? <laughs> <laughs> Luckily, that won't happen with the real thing. When the wind's strong, it'll spin the blades faster and make lots more electricity. Can you think of things that run on electricity? Uh, TVs, DVD players, fridges, lights, bananas, bananas. <laughs> bananas? <laughs> what? That was close, Jess. We'd better be careful. Oh, no. No, no, no! Come back! Whoa! <coughs> oh! Whoa. It's too dangerous to drive with all these magazines flying about. Let's help Michael pick them up. Oh, oh. Come back, you! Oh! <coughs> gotcha! <coughs> Jump on it, Jess! Well done, Jess. Thanks. Got them all now. Thank you, Pat. No problem, Michael. Come on, Jess. Meow. We've got to get this special delivery to Ted before the wind gets any worse. Meow. Oh, Look at this, this, Sarah. Oh. I wish Pat was here with the wind singer. Me too. It's been ages. I didn't touch anything. The wheel must have stopped turning. <gasps> oh, it's stuck. I've no electricity without the water wheel. <gasps> Don't worry, everyone. Ted knows what to do. Right, Ted? Aye. As soon as Pat gets here with the new generator, we'll have the power up again. Come on, Dad. Special delivery service. Pat speaking. Pat, we've got an emergency. The power's down at the water mill. Ted needs the generator there as soon as possible. Don't worry, Ben. We've met a few obstacles along the way, but we're almost there now. I'll put my foot down. <laughs> Pat! Pat! What happened? Why have you stopped? Are you all right? We're OK. But the road's blocked. Can you find me another way to Ted's? Yep. Hold on. The only other way is a dirt track to your left, crossing Alf's land. The special delivery service has permission to use it in emergencies. Great. Thanks, Ben. We're on our way. Yeah. Hold on, Jess. This might get bumpy. We've got to get to Ted's and fast. Don't worry. There's 
is just the sort of emergency I designed my wind generator for. Are you all right, Charlie? Yeah. I mean, it's just wind. Really, really strong wind. That's all. I'm not scared. Uh... Charlie? What? Charlie, listen to me. What makes the wind generator spin again? The wind. How? The wind makes the blades turn, which works machinery, inside the mill. Oh, I see. <sighs> Feeling better? Yeah. Thanks. No problem. Look. Oh, wow. Wow. Rosie. This is all we need. Rosie, come on, go. Home we go. Come on. Oh, thanks, Pat. I've been looking for air everywhere. Oh, the wind's too strong. Here, let me help. Oh, no. The van. No. Oh, wait. Oh, sorry, but what are you going to do? I don't know, but I'll think of something. Oh, heck. I want to go home now. Dad'll be here soon. That's right, Julian. But what if it doesn't come? That's not going to happen. Is it, Ted? Course not. I'll just see if he's coming. <laughs> the door's stuck. How will we get out? I've got to think of a way to get the wind generator to Ted. The power's out, and the kids are there. We must be able to drink a summit. It's a shame. On a day like today, that would be spinning like crazy. Of course. Alf, you're a genius. How's this going to work? I've attached the generator to the back of the van. When the wind blows, the blades will turn around and push the van forward. A bit like a boat. When I give the signal, you pull the stick. OK. Right. Now, Alf. Lift off. <laughs> I've got power. Huh? It's working, but it's working. Thanks, Alf. Whoa! Go, Pat! <laughs> ben, special delivery back on track. Brilliant news, Pat. Well done. It's spooky in here, Miss. Are there monsters outside? No, Bill. There aren't any monsters. What is that? Oh. Oh. We heard the noise. Oh. Hello, everyone. Dad! Hello, Dad! You made it! Oh. <laughs> OK, everybody. Here goes. Oh, no. The wind stopped. I know. Let's blow on it. <gasps> Just wait a second. 
I'm sure it'll... Ted? Well, we wouldn't have power without but. Well done, Dad! Special delivery service. Mission accomplished. My new hat. Thanks, Pat. Any time, Arthur. Um, how do I look? Oh? Hello? Special delivery service? Pat, it's Ben. The sorting machine is broken. I can't switch it off. But Ted's got something that can help us. Great! I'll go to the garage and collect it immediately. The post is depending on it. Don't worry, Ben. We're on our way. See you later, Arthur. Come on, Jess. We've got another special delivery. What's it going to be today? <coughs> What's it going to be? Oh, no! Oh, what a mess! Oh, 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 ow! Hello, Ted. I've come to collect Ben's special delivery. Oh, I. It's already but. Follow me. These fellas are going to help Ben sort the post. Wow! Robots! <laughs> Yes, sorry, Ted. Don't worry, Pat. Watch this. Please sort the nuts from the bolts and put them back on the shelf. Sort nuts and bolts. Put on shelf, yes. They can sort anything. <laughs> and they'll do whatever you ask. It's a good job you didn't ask them to put me in the shelf. Pop on shelf, yes. Oh, help! Oh, put me down! Hey! Oh, help! Pop down, yes. Oh, oh, oh. oh, They've got very powerful hearing sensors. They could even hear you talking from a different room. I better be careful what I say then. Meow. If you have any trouble, just hit the off switch. Right. Oh, and don't get them wet. It could damage their circuits. Don't worry, Ted. They'll be nice and dry in the mail centre. <laughs> Shush, everyone. Today, we're going to give the classroom a good spring clean. Oh! oh spring cleaning? Julian and Bill, you're on puzzles. Mira and Lizzie, please put the books back on the shelves. Everyone else, you're on floor clearing duty. Oh, well, this is fun. I know. I love tidying. Me too. Girls. <sighs> no, I can't reach it. No. Oh. Come on, Pat. Oh, Jess. Look at your messy paws. If you were a car, I'd ask you to go through the car wash to get clean. Go through car wash. Car wash, yes. There, there. All done. Pancaster Mail Centre. Hello there, Ben. I was just wondering why the Greendale Post is late. Sorry, Mrs Goggins. Slight technical hitch with the sorting machine. We'll soon have everything running smoothly again. Bye. Oh, come on, Pat. Go 
little car wash. Car wash, yes. Don't go in there. You get wet. Oh, no. The robots will have the post sorted in no time, Ben. <gasps> oh, no. The robots. Where are they? <coughs> Hello. Pat speaking. But the robots have just gone through the car wash. The car wash? <coughs> I mentioned the car wash to Jess. They must have heard me. Ted, I'll be right over. My butt. What's happened? The robots have escaped. Don't worry, Ben. I'll get them back. Stop! Stop! Come here! Here! Stop! The robots are over here. They've gone! Robots? We've got to find them. Let's split up and search Pencaster. I'll try the market. Right, old butt. We'll cover the rest. Uh, what do we do if we find the robots? Hit the off switch. Hello, Mrs Goggins. Has the post come yet? Sorry, Amy. There's a technical hitch at the mail centre. Oh, dear. I'm waiting for some medicine for Pumpkin. I'll call Ben again and see what's happening. Thanks, Mrs. Doggins. Oh, that's odd. There's no answer. Oh, technical hitches. I think we should go and see if Ben needs our help. Great idea. Watch out! Help! Hey! My cheeses! My goodness! <laughs> Fish sort banana. Fish sort banana, yes. Oh! Oh no! Oh dear! There they are! Oh, goodness me! Right, you wait here, Jess. Hey! Oh. Hey! Uh, uh, wait, wait! Whoa! Oh. Uh, they're going too fast! Oh. Oh, I'll never reach the off switch oh, now. My eggs. Ooh, ooh, whoa! Oh, thanks, Pat. You're very welcome. Oh, oh, oh. Naughty, naughty robots, doing what they should not. They must have thrown a gas in. There's water in their circuits. Naughty, naughty robots, doing what they should not. They keep on going faster. A digital disaster. They are. Ah. Ajay, stop that train. Ah. They're going to Greendale. Come on, follow me. Oh, D. B. Oh, Mrs. Goggins, Amy, help! Oh, 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 oh. 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 We'll just have to sort the post the old-fashioned way, by hand. But that'll take ages. Then we'd better get started. <coughs> oh! Um, did you see that? What? I thought I just saw two robots. <laughs> <laughs> robots in Greendale? <laughs> That'll be the day. Sarah, Nisha, have you seen two robots? They're my special delivery. Yes. They were heading towards the school. Thanks. I'll find them. Bye. Robots in, in Greendale? Greendale? Well done, everyone. Your classroom's looking great! Yes! yes. Oh, great! Now, because you've all worked so hard, I'm going to give you extra playtime. 
Thanks, Mrs. Taylor. Hello, my name is Bill. Welcome to Earth. Robots? Oh, no! Oh, no, I'm just tagging that. Stop! Stop! There they are. Come on, Jess. Ted, Arthur, they're inside. Pat, help! I'll stop them, Lauren. Come here! Oh! Not the puzzles. Puzzle sort. Puzzle sort, yes. They're trying to sort the puzzle pieces. I think they're drying out. Got it. Oh, I'll flick the switch. Done. Oh, thanks, Pat. <laughs> OK, you can switch him back on now. They're working. Hello. Robots, into the van, please. Into van, please. Into van, yes. I've got to get these robots to the mail centre as soon as possible. Yeah. I'll bring them back here to tidy up later. Bye, Dad! Thanks, Pat. Good luck! Yes! yes. <laughs> Look, here comes Pat with my special delivery. Here you are, Ben. One very special delivery. Oh, Pat, am I glad to see you. Robots, go and sort the mail, please. Sort mail. Sort mail, yes. Hey! hey! My medicine. Great. And this is for you, Mrs. Goggins. The Greendale Post. Thank you, Pat. Mend wire. Mend wire, yes. Look, they're fixing it. OK, I'll switch it back on. Right, Ben. It's working. Another successful delivery. Mission accomplished. Mission accomplished. Mission accomplished. So, the whole class is off to Pencaster for the day? Yes! The town hall's reopening and there's going to be a big ceremony and we're going to play a very important part. We don't know what it is, but Mrs Taylor says it's going to be really exciting. Special delivery service, Pat speaking. I've got an exciting delivery for you, Pat. How soon can you get here? We'll be with you right away, Ben. I'll see you later, Julian. Enjoy your day. Thanks, Dad. Bye. Bye, Pat. We've yeah. got a special delivery, Jess. What's it going to be today? Oh. Special delivery service. Is on his way. Special delivery service. What's it going to be today? Morning, Ben. Is this the new delivery? That's it, Pat. Careful. Ooh, ooh, ooh. What's inside it, Ben? I don't know, Pat. But it has to be delivered to the Reverend Tim's at the town hall by two o'clock. In that case, we better get it down. Garland's check. 
Streamers, check. Ribbon, check. Relax, Reverend. You're doing a fantastic job. I just want it all to be perfect. And what about my special delivery? I'm sure Pat has got everything under control. Oh, 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 oh! Can you reach it, Pat? Nearly. If I could just... <gasps> Careful, Jess. Oh. Well done, Jess. Now, let's get it into the van. How can something so light be so difficult to carry? Do you have time to drop this to Ted's garage? It's for his latest invention. No problem. I should have plenty of time. Bye, Ben. Bye, Pat. Good luck. And Mira. Yes, Mrs Taylor. Right. Everyone's here. Now all we've got to do is wait for the train to arrive. And here it is. Yes, Hello, kids. Up on board. Hmm. Hi, Ted. I've got a special delivery for you. Thanks, but Just what I need. Oil. Is that your latest invention? It certainly is. The Ted Glenn Automatic Expendable Picker Upper Device. Oh, useful if you want to pick things up. <laughs> want to give it a try? Sorry, Ted. I'm on a special delivery. <coughs> what have you got today? Anything interesting? Come and have a quick look. <coughs> Whoa. What have you got in there? I'm not sure. Why, it's floating. Oh, oh dear. Stop hey, that oh, box. Hey. Whoa. Oh, 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 oh. Well. Hey, oh. <gasps> Helium balloons. Now I understand. Come on, Ted. We've got to catch them before they disappear. We'll need your new invention and a step ladder. Listen, everyone. When we get to Pencaster Town Hall, each of you will be given a helium-filled balloon. What's helium, Mrs Taylor? It's a special gas that makes the balloon lighter than air. So if you let it go, it'll float away into the sky. You'll also get a label to tie on your balloon with your own special number and the address of the school. And then we'll let them go. Wow! Then somebody might find your balloon and write you a letter to tell you so. I wonder who will find my balloon. Mine will fly to France and a little French girl will find it. Mine's going further than France, America or China or... Mad! <laughs> <laughs> There they are. We're getting closer. What is it, Bonnie? Oh. Well, I never. Pat should definitely be here by now. Don't worry, Reverend. Pat will get your special delivery here on time. They're slowing, Jess. Soon we'll catch up with them, and Reverend Tims will get his delivery. Runaway balloons, you say? Sounds like a police matter to me. In which direction were they heading? Look, that way. Are you sure about this, Ted? The Ted Glenn Automatic Extendable Picker-Upper Device won't let us down. On 
second thought. Let's try the stepladder. That should do it. Hello, hello, hello. What's going on here, then? Oh, dear, oh, dear. Look at the time. No, pet. This is a job for an officer of the law. I insist. Easy does it, Arthur. Don't look down. Don't worry, pet. Can you detach the balloons one by one? Right. One. That's it, Arthur. And now, um, I, uh, uh, I don't know what to do, Pat. I can't untangle the others without letting go of this one. Tie it onto your button. What? Then your hands will be free to get the others. Good idea. The children will be here any minute, Reverend. Where can Pat be? I'm going to call Ben. Well done, Arthur. Brilliant! Ooh, hey, here, what's happening? Come on, put me down! Oh! Whoa! Now that's something you don't see every day. He left half an hour ago. What's happened to him, Ben? Oh. And what's happened to my... Look! Look! <gasps> oh. They're heading towards oh. the harbour! Can you get down there and wait in your boat, Ted? Of course. Do you mind if I borrow this? I've got a feeling it might come in handy. Come on, Jess. Where are you going? The mail centre. This is a job for the helicopter. Whoa! Ooh! Ooh! Whoa! Whoa! Ooh! He's heading towards the harbour bed. We need to get him down as soon as possible. I'll have the helicopter ready for your arrival, Pat. Over and out. Oh, this isn't so bad. Quite relaxing, actually. Far above the hurly-burly of the... Eh? Ooh! Now then, we'll have none of that. Move along now. There's nothing to see. Everything's ready for you, Pat. Thanks, Ben. <laughs> Goodbye, Pat. Good luck. Oh, dear. I'm going out over the lake. Perhaps this isn't so relaxing. Oh dear, oh dear. It's all right, Arthur. Pot's on his way. <sighs> We've lost the balloons and PC Selby. The whole event's completely ruined. Don't worry, Reverend. I'm sure Pat. Look! Will... It's Pat! It's Dad! He'll save PC Selby! Yeah! yeah. Going to lower the winch, Arthur. Try and grab hold of it. Right out, Pat. I'll have to come down a bit. Whoops. It's no good. The wind from the rotors keeps pushing you away. Oh dear. <laughs> I'm going to try something else. Right out, Pat. Do you think you can grab hold of the mast? I'll try. Ready, Ted? Champion. I can't get you any closer, Arthur. Do you think you can... <laughs> no, Arthur. Grab the mast. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa. One 
for you, one for you, and one for Mira. I'm so sorry. That's the last one. Of course. One of the balloons got burst when Pat rescued PC Selby. Try not to mind, Mira. I don't. Not really. You can share mine. Are you sure? But of course, it'll stop us arguing about whose balloon will travel farthest. Yeah, tie on your label. Oh, thanks, Julian. Are we ready? Yes! yes. Then release the balloons. Oh, wow. It's all down to you, Pat. You got them here on time. <coughs> And rescued PC Selby, of course. Of course! Special delivery service! Mission accomplished!